Welcome to the Northern Virginia Market Watch, brought to you by Real Estate Business Intelligence, an MRIS company. Let's examine the most recent numbers from the Northern Virginia housing market, which includes these areas. During the second quarter of 2012, the pace of national economic growth slowed, and it became evident the recovery will be protracted. The U.S. economy added 80,000 jobs in June, below forecast and far below the pace needed to significantly lower the unemployment rate. Job growth averaged 75,000 per month in the second quarter, compared to 226,000 monthly during the first quarter, and many economists anticipate slow job growth throughout the summer and possibly into the fall. Consumers and businesses remain cautious in their expectations about the future, largely because of political and economic uncertainty. While congressional negotiations continue, there seems to be little movement toward a compromise that would avoid the $1.2 trillion in mandatory federal spending cuts scheduled to go into effect on January 2nd. Taxes also remain a source of uncertainty. President Obama proposes an extension of the Bush-era tax cuts for families earning up to $250,000. However, Republicans argue that higher income households should also be included. Reports from the national housing market remain upbeat. Sales and pending sales activity are up with most metropolitan areas experiencing price increases. New construction is also rebounding. The number of new housing starts has risen to its highest level in four years. While the national housing market shows signs of life with prices and construction activity, it's important to interpret these trends with caution as the nation's political and economic situation continues to evolve throughout this election year. The Northern Virginia economy continues to show strong growth. The unemployment rate in Northern Virginia is just 4.1 percent, one of the lowest regional unemployment rates in the nation. Over the past 12 months, the region has added about 28,000 workers. There is ample evidence that demand is rising in the Northern Virginia housing market as the inventory of homes for sale continues to fall. The 6,995 active listings at the end of June are 20.1 percent below this time last year. The 4,093 new listings entered reflect the lowest number of June new listings the region has seen since 2000. While the inventory is declining, sales activity is gaining momentum. There were 3,522 homes sold in June, the highest monthly sales total in two years. New pending sales declined 13.5 percent from last month in line with a seasonal pattern. The low supply of active listings coupled with strengthening sales activity is impacting the region's housing market in several ways. There is upward pressure on sales price. The median price in Northern Virginia was $410,000 in June, 2.5% higher than June 2011 and the highest level seen since October 2007. The average days on market is 45, down from 51 days a year ago. The sale to list price ratio has also narrowed, increasing to 97.4% from 96.5% in June 2011. The current dynamics in the Northern Virginia housing market point to increasing demand, higher prices, and quicker sales in the coming months. The number of active listings should eventually increase to meet this growing demand, though it is unclear when this will occur. Many potential sellers are still faced with significant equity loss and could be waiting for prices to climb further. That's the Northern Virginia Market Watch for this month. Check back next month for the latest.